Hey guys, welcome to another episode of JREM Investigations. My name is Shane, aka Rem. I'm fighting off a sinus infection, that's why I sound all clogged up and like Bob Dylan. Tonight I'm hosting this investigation without Jay. He's uh, pretty sick and he had to sit this one out. But I really wanted to get down here to Bisbee, Arizona. I am with H uh, behind the camera and I also brought our dog Bandit. Hopefully he doesn't make too much noise as we try to debunk or prove that this house is active. So a little personal history on this location. Uh, last June, we stayed here as a little weekend getaway and I heard what appeared to be a child's laughter coming from the kitchen behind me as I took a quick nap in the living room. When we started this channel, this was one of the first places that came to mind where I had recently experienced some paranormal activity. Bisbee is an old mining town that was constructed in the 1800s. It has a pretty interesting history. If you guys wanna check that out, I'll leave a link in the bio where I found some of my information. So without further ado, Casa de Conflict. <clears throat> this is the main living area. That's my dog. Old furnace. Here's the dining area. Kitchen. And this is where I believe that laughter was coming from. So that's the lower level, and I think we're gonna try to do some EVPs quick. All right guys, we're gonna try an EVP session real quick with the recorder. Tonight I'm gonna listen in on headphones, um, kind of in real time to see if I pick anything up. I'm not sure if it'll work or not. We, I'll still have to go back and look through the footage, but um, let's give it a shot. All right, we're in the living room. Recorder is on the coffee table. Is anyone with us tonight? All right, we're in the living room. Recorder is on the coffee table. Is anyone with us tonight? Do 
if somebody's here, you can speak into this uh, voice recorder I have here on the coffee table. Did you used to live here? That was Bandit. Are you sure? He moved. It sounded like wood creaking. He's sleeping. Did you used to live here? That was Bandit. Are you sure? He moved. It sounded like wood creaking. He's sleeping. That sounded like someone stepping on a step. I don't know. That was my elbows. On the coffee table. Could you hear that? The creak? Yeah, I thought it was him. He's sleeping. He's awake a minute ago. Yeah, but he's not on any wood, is he? It could have been his nails on the kennel. No, that was wood creaking. I can hear it through my headphones. Okay, we'll review it later. Did you just try to take a step on the stairs? There's a noise there. Did you hear that? Yeah. And that wasn't Bandit. He's not moving. No, that's not Bandit. Was that you that just made a noise? Are you upstairs? All right, guys, we just did an EVP session. We'll have to review that footage. Um, we're going to bust out the spare box. After the last location, the haunted warehouse, I admit that I am a tad bit nervous. Um, I'm going to continue testing out this tinfoil theory, though. Um, I'm going to cover this in tinfoil so we do not get any radio waves or very low, a low rate of radio waves. So without the tinfoil... Too many radio waves, but there's um, three radio stations, I should say. That is that much at all. Right, if anyone's here, you can speak into this speaker, this device I have. Let's move it into the kitchen. Okay. Is 
there anyone in here? You can uh, speak into this device. Is there anything you wish to tell us? Yeah. Well, do you want to move upstairs? Yeah, shut this off. We have the Vivitar set up up here. Let's try doing a EVP session. All right, guys, we're going to try another EVP session upstairs now. Um, once again, I'm going to use my headphones to see if I can hear anything on the spot. Anybody uh, up here? You can speak into this little black recorder I have sitting here. Neighbor. You're that close? Not really. I could hear that clear as day. All right, guys, we're going to try a spirit box session real quick. Um, see if we get anything on the second floor. Power on. Now in SP Discovery. Is anybody uh, with us tonight? All right, guys, I just took about three hour nap, probably. Uh, it's about one in the morning. And we're going to try to capture something either on video or the spirit box. Uh, we want to give this another shot. All right, guys, we just concluded our investigation uh, between a few EVP sessions and spirit box sessions. So far, um, there's really no hard evidence that um, there's any spirits here. We'll have to go back through the footage to see if anything is uh, 
on any of the footage. I think without Jay being here, um, it kind of throws off the dynamic. So um, hopefully at our next location, we'll uh, be able to catch something. And like uh, Jay's explained in the past videos, uh, we're not always going to catch something. Some nights it's just, it's not gonna happen. So, and that's kind of why we're here as well, to kind of debunk any claims of any paranormal activity. So, uh, see you next time in Phoenix. Okay, in Phoenix. <laughs> see you later, guys. Hey guys, thank you for watching another episode of j Investigations. I feel a lot better, I'm at 100%, ready to go on the next investigation. So, Shane, what do you think you and Hannah caught um, during this latest investigation at Casa de Conklin? Um, initially, I didn't think we caught anything, mm -hmm. but um, after putting this episode together, it's pretty clear that there's a few spirits in that house. Interesting. <laughs> We'd also like to thank Neuron Spectre for letting us use this music as always on our videos. And we'd also like to thank our hosts of Casa de Conklin for letting us use their Airbnb during this investigation. In case you guys want to stay there yourselves, um, go right ahead, see what you get. Yeah, just like Shane said, for those of you who are interested in visiting the Casa de Conklin and maybe doing your own investigation, we'll leave the description link down below with all the info that you guys need. If you like any of this content that we put out and any other future content that we put out, be sure to hit the like button. And if you're new here, hit the subscribe button. And also, if you guys like to suggest a place out of all the videos that we've done, if there's anywhere you'd like for us to go reinvestigate, leave us a comment down below. And today sending us off out of Sioux Falls, South Dakota, is Adapsis. Yes. And we'll see you guys on our next location. Take care, guys.